I've never seen him outside the jury box. The beginning of his head. Uh, juror driving his way on to a trial. I've never in my 25 years as a prosecutor seen anything like it. Mr. Anderson, is it at all possible that your daughter knew this man? No. Stephen? I know most of my sister's friends. He's not one of them. And if he was, why would he have done this? Why would he put my sister's shot at justice in jeopardy? I don't think I need to tell you how catastrophic this could be to the city's legal system. Now, I need Joe McCusick's murder solved. How bad are things, Lou? It's pretty bad. Just this morning at Wadir, I had potential jurors expressing fears for their own personal safety. Now, the people of New York need to be assured that they are protected. Keep me in the loop. For all the years I've been in command of the 12th Precinct, you know how many times the district attorney has shown up? Once. Today. You heard the man. Let's get to work. Yes, sir. There is no Joe connection to Lila Addison. There's nothing in her financials, her murder file, her emails, her texts, not even her yearbook. Joe and Lila have absolutely nothing in common. It's like the two of them didn't even live on the same planet. Same goes with Joe and Otis. There's no Joe connection in the Juvie files? No, not even close. Joe and Otis were sent to different Juvie halls at different times, and they ran in opposite neighborhoods. So why the hell did he want to get on that jury so bad? I think I got something. Do you have a connection? According to his credit card, Joe purchased a pay-as-you-go cell phone from the electronics store a couple months back. So? So he already had a cell phone. What's he need a burner phone for? Especially an anonymous one. And if he is using it, where is it? All right, take a crew to his apartment and see what you can find. That might be the break that we need. Yeah. Castle? Castle, can you stop playing around? Actually, I'm not playing around. I'm a little busy blowing this case wide open. This is a photograph of the Lucky Lewis at Lila's crime scene. This is a little magnification app. Recognize anyone? It's Joe. He was at Lila Addison's crime scene. No, he'd be there. Only three reasons for a civilian to be at a murder scene. One, they're dead. Two, they just happen to be in the immediate area. Three, it's our killer and he couldn't resist the compulsion to return to the scene of the crime. And which number do you think Joe is? I'm gonna go with three. He's our victim and our killer. Nice. Ah. 